Hi, I'm Angela and this is Instant Pot Like. Do you like making easy recipes? Well, I have another recipe for you. This one you commonly get it at dim sum. I love it because it's so vibrant and so tasty and it's actually really, really simple to make. It is pumpkin corn congee and you just need a few ingredients. So we have here our pumpkin puree. I actually made this previously in the Instant Pot. I just steamed my pumpkin and then I pureed it up and I store it in the freezer when I don't have time to use up the entire pumpkin and I just pull uh, a cup at a time when I'm making my kanji. You also need uh, cream stout corn. This is the one I use. And you need some rice. I use jasmine rice. I've already washed it. Check out my video if you need to see how to wash rice. You will need to use the measuring cup from the Instant Pot. Uh, it's me meant to measure rice. So if you use a full cup of this, that comes out to three quarter cups of the regular measuring cups that we use. That's about 250 milliliters. You will also need a little bit of salt and lots and lots of water for kanji. So I'll show you how to make it. We'll just start it up right now. All right, so first thing I like to put in is the rice. Just gonna spread it around here, nice and evenly. And then I'm gonna put in some of the cream style corn. and your pumpkin puree. And now, just need to pour in all the water. So once that's in, you don't need to stir it. We'll just close it up and we'll cook it up. So it looks like I forgot to put in the salt. You can put it in now, or you can put it in after when it's done cooking. I'm just gonna open it back up and put it inside. Select porridge for 20 to 25 minutes. You can also select pressure cook, high pressure cooking for 20 to 25 minutes. So I hope you enjoy your kanji and I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you next time.